Our question is distinguish between stock and flow. Give an example of each. Students, to distinguish between stock and flow, you always need to remember one basic concept. And that concept is that stock is always measured at a particular point of time. Whereas flow, it is always measured over a period of time. Right? Stock ko hum kya karte hai? Hamisha ek particular point of time pe measure karte hai. Aur flow ko over a period of time. So let's start with the meaning first. The meaning of stock. Stock refers to those variables which are measured at a point of time. Whereas flow refers to those variables which are measured over a period of time. Jin variables ko hum ek particular point of time pe measure karenge that is your stock. And jin ko hum over a period of time pe measure karenge that is your flow. Particular point of time pe hum kya kya measure kar sakte hai? For example, your balance sheet that is prepared at a point of time. For example, balance sheet as on 31st March 2021 that is your stock concept. Okay. If we talk about the flow, for example, I am depositing rupees 2000 every month in my account for one year. So that will be my flow because I am depositing 2000 every month for one year. So what is it? For one year. That is over a period of time. Let's start with the time dimension. If we talk about stock, stock do not have time dimensions. Right? Because stock ko hum kya karte? point of time pe measure kar rahe. So stock may koi bhi time dimension nahi hota. Whereas in flow, we have time dimensions because it is measured over a period of time. Isko hum ek proper period of time mein kya karte? Measure karte hai. Isi le flow mein there is always a time dimension so stock do not have time dimensions flow have time dimension it is measured over a period of time the next point is the concept stock is a static concept because there is no time dimension so it is always fixed if we talk about flow it's a dynamic concept because it has time dimension so it keeps on changing now the next point is your examples if you talk about the examples of stock then we have national wealth because it is measured at a point of time right and if we talk about the flow example then it is national income so that's it for this question if you like our content then please like this video and do subscribe to our channel and please share this video on whatsapp facebook linkedin and twitter if you have any question please drop a question in the comment section and for more such content, please visit our website rngacademy.com slash class 12 economic solution. Thank you.